Welcome to the Intuitive Solutions online trainings. Intuitive Solutions provides sales, implementation, training, and support for SuiteMed. We also offer billing services as well as data hosting. You can find us online at www.intuitivesolutions.net or call our toll-free number at 877-889-1011. My name is Dwayne Prejean, and I will be training today on National Drug Code, also commonly known as NDC. The first thing we'll do is we'll log into the software. Next, I will go under Setup and choose Prescription. Once there, I will double-click on Drug Categories. Our drug categories can be used when we're crafting the uh, tailoring the NDC code, and I'm going to create one for injection. I will save it and close. And the next thing I will do is go to drug. So under setup prescription, I'm going to choose drug. Here, I'm going to select the drop down for dispense. And the next part's a little tricky. I'm going to put in a code. I'm going to tab. I'm going to OK this message and then hit cancel. It leaves the field there. That's fine. The next thing I'll do is select my category, and that's what we just created, injection. I will then put in my 11-digit NDC number. The next thing I will do is populate my strength. Notice to the right there is a little icon. This icon will give you the legend that will be transmitted out on your claims. They only accept these four types, F2, GR, ML, and UN. You may type anything that you want, but it is ultimately only these types that will be sent. So if you wanted to type something called test as a, an NDC strength the way that you want to, we must categorize test as a specific unit, gram. So anything you type must be part of the NDC strength. However, we will send the appropriate qualifier for it. Save and close. So we can pick our strength, and I'm just going to put in test just to show you. And then I'm going to put in our strength value. The next thing I need to do is put in the required field of Rx bottle quantity. And I'm just going to pick a CPT code here. The next thing I'm going to do is save. After that, I'm going to go to that specific CPT code under Setup of Bill and link that CPT code with the NDC code. I will select it, and next thing I will go right up here and select the NDC code that we created and save it. At this point, I'm ready to begin my billing. I will do a manual charge posting in this example of a new charge using that code. Putting in a price. And notice when I click on the CPT icon at the very end of the line, it brings in the information that I need. If you had created and linked your CPT to the NDC after the bill was created, then you will need to edit that particular charge, go to the end of the line, click on the CPT code, and simply drop down and type in the information that you need so that when you resubmit the claim, it goes out. However, if it was linked before you create the bill, it will pull it in for you. I will click OK and save. That concludes the NDC. Thank you.